What I wanted to show today is how to create a little list of animated servo positions and control a servo motor using CircuitPython. So here you can see the basics of it are that I'm importing some libraries, time so that I can pause, board for pin definitions, PWM, that's pulse width modulation, out so that we can send these uh, signals to the servo to tell it what position to go to, and then the Adafruit motor servo library. We then set up the servo object, and I'm calling it servo A, servo.servo on my PWM out on board pin A1 is what I've plugged it into on my little feather here at a frequency of 50 hertz. The minimum pulse duration is 500, maximum pulse is 2,375. These are values you can tune to adjust per servo to get things close to zero and 180 degrees. Then I'm setting up this list of animation tuples, essentially, that contain a position, so 0, 90, 45, these are all degrees, and time, how long I want to dwell on those. And this is so we can do some sort of an animation. Then we have a little variable called animation pose or position, and that's which of those uh, items in that dictionary are we using. And then the main loop of this, we set the angle variable and seconds to be that pair of numbers that come from that list. We print out the value. You can see it printing to my serial port here. Then we set the servo to that angle, so it just jumps to it immediately. I'm not doing anything fancy with uh, easing, which I think I will for a future episode. And then we pause for that time value in seconds, and then we increment using a sort of modulo function to just loop through that list forever and ever. So you can see if I plug in the servo, it's been running this whole time, I just didn't have it plugged in. So now I'm gonna plug in power ground and that PWM out. And now you can see my servo is going to go between those positions that I have, hang out for some various durations of time. I have it moving faster or slower, or holding longer and shorter, I should say. Uh, and then looping, so it repeats that motion. So it's a really neat way to set up a repeating animation. So that is how you can set up a list of animation positions on a servo motor inside of CircuitPython. And that is your CircuitPython Parsec.